Hi guys, Lemmy here. Welcome back to my final week of Inktober, I guess, technically. This is just the recap where I'm going to be flipping through the pages of the sketchbook and talking a little bit about Inktober. And I consider this to be a challenge, and I know that I put some art videos up that are art challenges on my channel. This is definitely a challenge for me because I'm not used to doing a challenge that is every day of a month, and this challenge requires a lot of dedication. I remember starting out, the very first week was a whole lot of fun, and it was really easy to do. A bunch of other artists started doing Inktober as well, and then over the course of the month, everyone started dropping out, and I was just like, oh my gosh. And I was always a few days behind and I would catch up, but as soon as I would catch up, it would be like, oh, it's midnight, now I'm another day behind. And it was just, after a while, it became kind of stressful. And I would say if I didn't have anything else to do art-wise this month, it would have been really easy for me to accomplish this. But with the Patreon and commissions, and Friday art videos and reviews and like working with other companies and doing other things it just became all like really stressful to complete all these things and I like doing both pages on either side of a sketchbook so what I really liked about this challenge was that I have this really cool sketchbook on both sides you have like all these pictures made with all these different kinds of pens and like you can see here with the cat I used India inks and I've had them for a while but I never actually got to use them so during this challenge it was sort of fun because you could do something different every day and have all these different styles appear that you wouldn't normally be drawing and use all these different supplies you might not have normally used and over the course of the month, I ended up ordering extra supplies that I did want to try out. And I got used to brush pens, which was something that I didn't have that much experience with, but now I feel a lot more confident using them. So there are definitely um, pluses to doing Inktober, no doubt. Especially if you don't sketch daily, this gave you the opportunity to practice. And if you practice, if you go from sketching maybe once a week to once a day, in the course of that month you will improve much more than you would have normally. So um, you can see this is like the end of the, the Inktober sketchbook. I'm going to show you Friday's video actually as a little spoiler right here. This is Friday's three marker challenge that I'm doing. and. Um, yeah, so this was a really great challenge and it was a lot of fun, but I don't think I'm going to be doing it again. And if I do do it again, it'll just be a few ink pictures in the month of October or a week maybe, but it was just a lot of work. Um, but now I have this cool sketchbook that I can look through. So while it was a lot of work, I'm really happy that I did it so that I have something at the end of it that I can appreciate and go back to and, and still enjoy it. Um, but yeah, I really enjoy doing this art challenge and I'm thinking about doing more and I was wondering what you guys would like to see because Friday's three marker challenge, I want to know what other sorts of challenges you would like to see. I was thinking about doing the cheap art supply challenge because a lot of people seem to be like liking that lately, so I thought maybe you guys would like to see it. But let me know if you have any other ideas, I'm definitely open to them. Uh, challenges are really fun and I find them to be relaxing, except for this Inktober challenge <laughs> was not relaxing. But <laughs> normally I find challenges very relaxing and they're fun and different and they're not the same old thing. You know, it's just something different, and each artist has their own take on it. So if you can leave your suggestions below, that would be great. And I'll talk to you again on Friday. All right, take care. Bye, guys. Oh, by the way, at the end of the video, there's going to be all four weeks. So if you want to click on those links, it'll take you to the speed paints that I did within those weeks. So if you want to see any of the pictures that you saw in this video today, be created, click those links. All right, <laughs> I'm going for real. Bye, guys.